hello everyone and welcome back to another exciting tutorial so today i'm going to show you how you can create this cookies box design in adobe photoshop so let's start the video i need an artboard size of 7.5 inches into 3 inches and i'll choose 300 resolution for this design let's apply gradient and let's change the color let's change the opacity to 100 percent and let's change the color click ok and change the angle to minus 90 and let's adjust this gradient a little bit next let's take the ellipse tool and let's draw an ellipse round about here and let's change the color let's remove the stroke select this ellipse layer and duplicate this using ctrl j now change the fill color of this ellipse to this one then click ok and let's reduce the size of this ellipse and move this ellipse around about here now select this ellipse and duplicate this using ctrl j and this time let's apply gradient to this ellipse Hold the Alt and click on this ellipse to clip this. Now select this ellipse and let's reduce the size. Next, let's import our cookies and dry fruit images. so i have imported all the images in this design let's adjust these images Let's add shadow to coconut. Duplicate this and also apply to this coconut. Let's 
import our text effect to this design I'm using this text effect for this cookies box design this is fully editable text effect I will provide the link in the description of this text effect video let's copy this and paste this in Adobe Photoshop as smart object reduce the size select all these cookies and dry fruit images and group these let's bring this text effect layer down right about here let's group these logo layers and change the name let's add some more text duplicate this and try more text change the color increase the size and let's apply a little bit arc effect to this cookies world okay next let's select this logo layers and let's tilt them a little bit if you don't want to do this it's completely up to you okay let's add I think let's increase the size okay let's add one more rectangle just above the background let's remove the stroke first and and let's fill this with this color now let's apply bevel and emboss effect to this ellipse first let's select this ellipse using pressing control 
next press control and alt and then click on this ellipse this blue layer ellipse and now let's apply mask to this ellipse click on mask and the mask will be applied so we need this kind of ellipse next keep selecting this brown chocolatey color ellipse then go to effect blending options click on bevel and impose change the depth to 220 change the size to 60 pixel click on use global light then change the angle to 152 change the altitude to 53 click on gloss contour to this one change the highlight mode blend option to normal change the color to this one change the opacity to 100% change the shadow mode blend mode to normal click on color change the color to this one then click OK change the opacity to 60% and then click OK next select this ellipse and then go to effect blending options bevel and impose click on reset to default keep the depth to 100 percent keep size to 40 pixel click on use global light and uncheck this change the angle to 131 change the altitude to 32 keep the gloss contour to as it is and change the opacity to highlight mode opacity to 100 percent and the change the shadow mode opacity to 10 percent then click ok let's add a brand logo You can add your logo too. This is a sample logo, so you can add anything. This is a very simple logo. Copy this. Let's go to Photoshop and paste it as smart object. Let's decrease the size and place it here. Now let's add a line pattern to our background. For that, I'll go to what I'll go to Illustrator. This is simple line pattern as you can see. Bring this down just above the background. Let's change the angle of these lines. And change the blend mode to color touch. So here is our final cookies box design. I hope you have learned something from this video. 
please do like and subscribe to my channel and also share this video with your friends so everybody can learn thanks for watching